I think the environment is is extremely challenging at the moment. We have a, a Congress that's been quite dysfunctional. We have priorities that have not been clear from the Pentagon for, for some time, and then they change even when they are articulated. And so industry is facing a declining defense budget, priorities that are unclear, funding that changes constantly. And, and what it does is create an environment where, where leaders don't know what kinds of decisions to make. They don't know how to invest. They don't know what sort of equipment and capital to, to invest in for the future. And, and it's really unclear what kind of talent you need to have. I've been in this business for over 40 years, and I don't recall any time, even in the best of times, when, when the environment was so uncertain about what our customers needed and what the funding streams might be for the next few years. Obviously, defense leads technological change in very many areas, and the key capability today, of course, are based on remote systems, how you are able to deploy force without putting men and women in harm's way. And I think that actually sits not only alongside technological change, but the increasing unwillingness of governments in the West to put uh, their armed forces in harm's way. Uh, And that is something that I think technology and political opinion are moving in the same direction. 